Right, uh, front page, what we got? Well, uh, I know normally we talk about light-hearted, happy stories in this section, but there's a story I must bring to your attention, which is actually the complete opposite. Pint of no return. The UK loses 28,000 pubs as young yeah. drink at home and chat on their mobiles. Now, the standard excuses have been wheeled out uh, for the number of pubs closing since the 1970s. Sky-high business rates, standard. More people drinking cheaper alcohol at home bought from the supermarket. That's not... That's always been the same. Well, ben, but young I, drink- I, I think it's clear... Crystal clear. And by the way, listen, I'm not, I'm not, um, I've got to be careful here because, you know, we had, um, you know, the Northern Ireland manager get done mm. for uh, drink driving. Now, now I'll, I'll just give you this scenario. So you're in Carlisle, you have a couple of pints, you drive over the border, you live five minutes into Scotland, mm. you can be stopped and done and you're yeah. over. Not in Carlisle, but in Dufres, you are done. It's, it's two separate drink drivers. Um, so they? what I'm saying here is, of course, I get done. You should not drink and drive. Absolutely. Um, I agree with that totally. But country pubs now, pff, forget it. Forget it. No one can go and have a couple of pints now. Well, there's a lot near, drive near me. Back. Ex- exactly. There's a lot near me down in Surrey. Mm. And uh, who wants to go and sort of sit and have three pints of, of cola of an evening? But uh, the young, the young, <laughs> well, it's true, isn't it? In, no, it in, is. In, in a scratch, village. It's one yeah. thing being in like, an, an urban scenario, but out in the sticks, they're yeah. really struggling. But the one that really interested me was that the young people want, would rather chat on their mobiles. So the pubs could end up closing and you could have a scenario where people are sat on sort of FaceTime or video chat with a can or a glass of something and just do it over the internet. But I go, out to dinner. I, go, I, I go out to dinner with my wife and I sit there and a young couple come in and they don't talk to each other. They're on their mobiles. Yes. It's just ridiculous. I've banned it in my house now. I, I said, couldn't we, agree more. When we sit and have dinner, the phones are When elsewhere. dinner has to go away, mate. It has yeah. to go away. It's just really, really daft, isn't it? It is. Crazy. Well, just think yourself. Just take a moment and think. If you didn't have a mobile phone now... Oh no, time oh, and place. It'd, it'd, it'd be no, but it'd be. You think what? You'd be lost. You can't think without it, can you? If you leave, ha- if you leave your home without your phone, you feel you're lost for the day. Yeah. It's People say fact. they feel naked without their phones. Is that right? There's a thought. It's bad. Yeah. bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for? 